Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Roxanne and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing season one, episode 35 of Sailor Moon called Returning Memories, Usagi and Mamoru's Past. So Luna got even more memories unlocked. Apparently they had to wait for Princess Serenity to fully awaken to get um, more memories back. So Princess Serenity fended off Zorsite and then um, Mamoru and um, started to remember her, his true name, which is Endymion. And that she gave him the locket and that he sacrificed himself to save her. Then Seven Moon is kind of back and she passed out because of all the, I guess, power surging through her. It just, it just weakened her and she just, she passed out. Then Kunzai took Mamoru and left and Beryl is very upset. <laughs> and uh, she'll allow one more chance with Zosai. And then we cut to where Zosai is gone. And then we cut to where Beryl takes um, Mamoru down to see Metalia, which is like the, the one in charge of Beryl, and heals him and starts to brainwash him. Then Zosai, like I said, is gone. And then we cut to where Ami is trying to find a way out of the tower. Then Sailor Moon is awake and they share even more memories. And basically Metalia took over the earth and then she wanted the legendary silver crystal and wanted to take out the moon kingdom. And basically that they are reincarnates of their past selves. So Sailor Moon is out. She's like, I'm done. I don't want to fight anymore. I'm sick of it. Then Sailor Moon, I mean Sailor Mars, literally slaps her and um, sets her straight-ish. <laughs> And then we cut to where Ami found a way out, but they got blocked by Kunzai, and then they have a really cool action scene, and then he sends it back and got knocked out. Then some Moon versus Kunzai, and she handled him, and Beryl starts to brainwash him, and that was in the episode. Um, I think it was actually Zorosai that she handled. I'm not quite sure. Anyway, she handled it. Anyway, it was a really good episode. I really enjoyed it. I gave it an A plus because like we get to see this dynamic. She kind of reverted back to like her very early on where she's like, I don't want to fight. I just want to be a normal girl. And so we kind of see like a little taste of that because she did grow a considerable amount within the 35 episodes. So she had a nice little regression back because of that horrible tragedy. And now she's pretty much got all of her memories restored and still flooding back to her. So I thought overall it was a great episode and I thoroughly enjoyed it. So um, that's going to do it for this video. So if you like this video, please go to like, comment down below, tell me what you think of the episode. Do you agree? Do you agree? Tell me your thoughts down below and what other shows do you want me to do reviews for? Uh, it might be, well, I don't know if everything's going to go and I'll have tons of time to do videos. <laughs> anyway, that's it. I hope y'all will subscribe and join me for more episodes and more reviews um, slash reactions because actually some of these I've never seen before and that's kind of crazy to me. So anyway, I'll see you in my next video. Bye everybody.